It's not just a bad hair day, it's a real rabbit horror story. Across parts of the United States, cottontail rabbits are being spotted with terrifying black spikes and tentacle-like growths sprouting from their heads. These Frankabunnies look like something out of The Last of Us, but the cause is very real. A rapidly spreading disease called cottontail papillomavirus, or CRPV. In Fort Collins, Colorado, Susan Mansfield noticed a strange rabbit in her yard. At first glance it looked normal, but when it turned she saw black quills or black toothpicks sticking out all around his or her mouth. She assumed it wouldn't survive the winter, but it returned the next year, and the growths were bigger. Others have reported rabbits with jagged black spikes covering their faces, some so overgrown they could barely eat. One person described the infected animal as having a scabbish looking growth over their face. CRPV, also known as Shope papillomavirus, is spread by parasites like ticks and fleas, which transmit the virus through their bites. Infections are more common in summer when these insects are active. Once infected, rabbits develop wart-like tumors around their heads and necks. Over time, these tumors can harden, darken, and resemble twisted spikes or tentacles. While some wild rabbits recover, severe cases can lead to starvation if the growths block their mouths or impair their vision. The phenomenon isn't new. In 2013, a Minnesota resident posted a viral video of a rabbit with grotesque horn-like protrusions, which he nicknamed the Frankenstein Bunny. Many compared it to the mythical jackalope, a prank creation where antlers were sewn onto taxidermy rabbits, but this was no hoax. Since then, cases have been reported across the Midwest and beyond. Wildlife officials warn the public not to approach or handle these animals. While CRPV cannot infect humans or pets, the fleas and ticks on infected rabbits can carry other dangerous diseases. If you see one, keep your distance advises Caravan who's from Colorado Parks and Wildlife. Take a photo if you want, but don't interfere. Domestic rabbits are especially at risk. The disease can progress more aggressively in pets, sometimes leading to squamous cell carcinoma, a serious and potentially fatal skin cancer. Infected pet rabbits may require surgery to remove tumors before they become life-threatening. Preventive measures, like flea and tick control, are essential. Unfortunately, CRPV has no known cure. While some rabbits survive, many do not. For pet owners, vigilance is key. For everyone else, it's important to remember that as fascinating as these mutant-looking creatures may be, they are suffering from a serious disease, and the kindest thing you can do is keep your distance.